This isn't a joke, Mildred. I'm not laughing, Maud. The old Mildred would have believed me. You're the one who's acting different. No, ever since your mum got here, you've changed. You're just, you're just jealous. Jealous of what? Of you? Yes, because I'm the best witch now from the best witchy family and you can't handle it. No, Mildred, you're the worst witch and you always will be. It was my dream to study at Cackles. Do you think they'll let me stay when everyone finds out? Who's that? It's my parents. They've sent a parcel to my bedroom. You go. I'll meet you in potions. I'm so sorry. Millie, the rules were very clear. One girl, one cat. If I followed every rule, I'd never have saved the academy. That was for the greater good. So is this. For my mum. Miss Cackle told you it was forbidden to give a non-magical person magic. Forbidden, Millie. My family gave up their magic to help others. All I'm doing is asking for it back. Being from a witching family doesn't mean you can suddenly do whatever you want. Cheating against your classmates to win a valuable prize. It's like something Ethel would do. If it's not the game, what else connects them? Looks like powder. Or clay dust. What we can contain, we can control. What we can contain, we can control. Uh, can I help you? I'm looking for Mr. Rowan Webb. As am I. He's not here at the moment, but... I will see you sneaking with me, Catherine. I... Also need a quick word. Stay back, all of you. Oh, what on earth is going on? Yeah. It can be Maud? What happened, Millie? Why were you bats? Ethel and Felicity trapped me in my room, and they were about to do something in spell signs too. Until Bat you stopped them. We should tell Miss Cackle. You have been asked to leave, Miss Harbroom. I'm sorry, but we can't. Ethel Hallow and Mildred Hubble are trying to sort this out by themselves. At my last school, I smashed my glasses right before the 100 metres and ran off course into a mud swamp. <laughs> the whole school laughed at me. Sorry. My dad took about a million photos. He's so embarrassing. Next time I volunteer to be director, you have permission to hit me with your broom. OK, let's take it from the top. 